Yeah, I already know it's back to school season, which means we need to go back to school shopping. And it being my senior year, it's not even a whole lot that I'm finna get, but like, we finna get some stuff. We finna get some stuff right now. We finna get some stuff. It ain't gonna be a whole lot though. So if you looking at this video and you think like, I'm finna go splurging, I'm really not. Because it being my upcoming senior year, like, I'm barely gonna be at school. And that means I'm barely gonna have classes, which means I barely need that many supplies. But yeah, stay tuned. Watch the whole video to the end. Make sure you subscribe if you have not subscribed already because the content is going to be coming like this every week. I was going to say every day, but every week the content coming like this. We post two times a week, which means eight videos a month. So if you want to be a part of the K gang, join the gang and subscribe. But yeah, I will see y'all when we are in the car and on the way to Staples. Just sent my camera back literally today, y'all. So hopefully I get it back before school actually starts. But yeah, let me go ahead and hush up and let y'all see what's going on. But yeah, yeah, I pretty much got everything that I need. Like, I don't want to just get stuff just to be getting it. Saying that I got it. Oh, I do need these for your lace though. She has these ones, but they're like smaller. But she be using it for us to make notes in our books. But she has the smaller ones. I don't want those. Those are huge. Oh, here they go. Here go the smaller ones. I think hers are like clear though, but we're just gonna, we're just gonna go with these. But that's really it, like, it's really not even a whole lot that I really truly need this year, cause like, I don't have that many classes, and in the classes that I do have, baby, I already took two of them before, so I really don't need a whole, I already know what I need in them classes, and it's really not even a whole lot of stuff. Yeah, I'm pretty much done. Nothing else for me to get out of here unless I see something else, but I already have a binder and all that because I didn't use one of the binders that I had last year, so yeah. I will see y'all when I get home to do the haul. Come on some pimp shit. Hey, kiss that you all about money. Yeah, I'm on that cash shit. I'm in my bag, bitch. I'm in your ass, bitch. Tell him his secrets, I probably forget it But I'ma tune in when he say he gon' make it He told him send me a pic cause he 
miss me. I told him, send me a snack if he really. I don't be trusting these tricks, they trick. Send him a pick of somebody else's titties. I'm a finesse and I'm a fly dresser. Move to the top on the in my dresser. My bitches hustle, make money together. Okay, hey y'all, I am back home from running the errands or not really running the errands, but getting the school supplies. And here is the haul. So the first thing I'm gonna show y'all is my book bag. I wanted to go to Kitty Book Bag this year because like, you know, that's what most seniors do. They get like a little Dora or a little Hop Patrol book bag, but I didn't want to get like no little, I don't know. I don't want to sound like bougie or nothing, but I didn't want to get a Walmart type of book bag because I've had a spray ground for going on, this going on my fourth year and we four years strong with the spray ground. So why would I switch it up? But yeah. This is actually the first time I've taken it out the package since I got it. And I got it like three weeks ago. So, yeah. Okay, so as y'all seen, the next thing I'm getting is... The next thing I'm showing y'all that I got is these pens, y'all. And the reason I got so many pens, like, y'all probably like, why did you need all these pens? I needed these because I need pens that I could use to take notes and things like that with. But I needed these pens because I had to take this class called IVELA. And my teacher, every time, like, if we do anything that we have to turn in in her class, you need a black or a blue pen. And, y'all, I don't know where all my black and blue pens went last year, but they went missing. And I was begging for black and blue pens because if I wrote in any other color but black or blue, she was going to literally give me a zero. Or, no, she wasn't going to give me a zero. She was going to take off 99 points. So I was going to get a one. Next thing I'm showing y'all is these pack of lead pistols. I got these from Target. I did not get these from Facebook today because I didn't need to because I already had them. So yeah, these are my pencils. And the reason I have so many pencils, y'all probably, probably like, why do you need so many pencils? This year, I'm not sharing no pencils. Like, for real. We're all seniors. You should have at least three pencils. I'm not sharing my pencils because... Every time I shared my pencils last year, my friends, I didn't expect you to get my pencil back. But if you just ask me for a pencil, and I didn't say, you could keep it, then give me my pencil back. But they never gave me my pencil back. And these are lead pencils. Of course, they was going to try to keep your lead pencils. You do not need to try to keep my lead pencils. You need to give my lead pencils back. So, yeah. These are my lead pencils. They are, I know you're probably kind of like, all of my school supplies had this little pastel thing to it. I really like y'all I didn't plan it it's just things that caught my eye but yeah all of my stuff this year is pretty much pastel colored even the book bag it's colorful and pastel so yeah but these are the pencils that I got next thing I got are these post-its and the reason I got these post-its is because I need them for ELA class she has us um so I don't know if all IB classes are like this or if it's just because of her. But she makes us like note take certain things in books. So like she'll give us, we'll have to find a sticky note or she'll supply us with them. But I just got my own so that she wouldn't have to supply me with it or anything. But yeah, she makes us, we need these in note cards in her class a lot. But if you don't have note cards, you can use these. But yeah, we need, she makes us annotate a lot of things. So I just went ahead and got me some. So I'm thinking smarter, not harder instead of trying to use hers and the whole class is trying to use hers so yeah got me supposed to notes for ibela as well next thing up is this notebook but it got something on it it did not have nothing on it in the store what's going on but yeah i got me a little notebook y'all and the room the reason i only got one notebook is because i only have the my two ib classes is the same class that i took last year i took ib year one for them and now i'm taking the ib year two for them so i didn't i realized what i did and did not need for those certain classes and my ib bio class we didn't even use a notebook we barely used anything but our computer in that class and a pencil and probably a pen but yeah so i didn't really get a whole lot like i didn't get anything for that for Ivy Bio, I mean Ivy ELA, we don't really use notebooks. If anything, we just need a loose leaf piece of paper. Um, the reason I got a notebook though is because I take math this year and I needed to make sure that I had something to keep my math notes in. I don't know if I'm going to need a notebook for math this year, but if I want to pass math, I'm going to have to take my own notes. So even if I don't use a notebook, I'm going to use it for my own personal good. But I know last year my math class, 
we didn't use a notebook. We we were supposed to, but the way that she talked, it was like you were the the second you open your notebook, we moving on to the next thing. And then she talked so fast, she don't really. Let me not get on started by that teacher, but I just got a notebook for math. This is my only notebook, so yeah. Next thing I got is these two folders. One for any loose leaf paper that my teachers give me that I need to keep up with. Both of these are gonna go in my binder, by the way. But yeah, this is for any paper that my teachers give me that I might need or like, you know, celebrate study guides. Any other type of paper that my teachers give me that I'm gonna need to do work with, that's gonna go in here. And it's paper that I'm gonna, like paper that I turn in and get back or anything like that is just gonna go in here. So yeah. Got two folders because you always need two folders. In it, when in doubt, you always need two folders. One for loose leaf paper and one for paper that you can get back. Next is my beats. My beats are a lifesaver. Headphones in general are a lifesaver in high school because all you gotta do is throw them on your head, connect it to your phone, and you can listen to your music. When you're walking in the hallways for church, this is time you don't want to talk to everybody all the time. You just want to play your music and walk to class. That's what a lot of people do in my school. I don't know if a lot of people do it, period, but I know in my school, like if you're walking in transition, like if you walk in our hallways during transition, you see pretty much everybody with their headphones, with some type of headphones on, and they're playing music and they're walking to class. And I know a lot of freshmen, I don't think a lot of freshmen really do that like in the beginning of the year but i know towards the end of the year you'll realize that they're doing it because it's just like you know you can listen to your music while you're walking to class it gives you something to you know not something to do but like who just wants to walk to class and hear the commotion like me when i'm walking to class and i'm not walking with my friends i just want to play my music even when i'm walking with my friends sometimes i still got my music going but i'm walking with my friends but yeah, I highly recommend y'all get some earbuds for school because you might not even, it's not even just to use for walking in the hallway. Headphones can go a long way in high school. You can use it for things on your computer, anything. Like, I highly recommend having headphones for school. Next thing is some regular paper. I highly suggest y'all get some regular paper. Don't just depend on your notebooks. Get some regular paper, one, to put in your binder, and two, just to have paper that you don't have to tear out your notebook and then tear off the other piece. Just have some regular notebook paper, y'all. You never know. You might need it. You're going to need it because I use all of it. So get some regular paper. Oh, the reason I only got one stack, though, is because, um, like I said, I really don't think that I'm going to be doing too, too, too much this year. So, yeah. Last but not least, we have the side down. A binder. Just a simple little binder. It's a one-inch binder. I don't really think, especially in high school, you don't need like a big, fat, thick binder. You really just need something that you can keep all of your stuff in and put in and things like that. This is my binder. This is pretty much the last thing that I've got. Other than my pencil pouch, but I'm using the same pencil pouch that I had last year this year because there's nothing wrong with that pencil pouch. And my emergency kit, which stay tuned for the next video where I will have things everything that i put in my emergency kit i will have in my emergency kit so stay tuned for that video but yeah that's pretty much it for my school supplies i hope y'all enjoyed this video comment down below some things that you if you haven't went school shopping some things that you think that you may need for any year coming up and i will see y'all in the next video i love y'all so 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 much and i will see y'all bye